All right, so as you can see, you can now get the 100% free Explorer Emily skin. This is the skin in Battle Royale right here, a phenomenal looking skin. And this is the same skin, but in Lego terms. So she's quite different in Lego world. She's got a hat on, whereas in this one, she doesn't. And you also get a free back bling called the Greebles. I don't know if that's accessible in Lego world though. I'm not sure if there even are back blings in that mode just yet. So I already did a video about this a few days ago because you could do this before the Lego mode even came out. The problem is they changed it up now and I'll show you that in just a second. So if you followed my tutorial I did the other day, it was on December 4th, you should log in today and get this skin. Now you might not get a pop-up though, because if you did my method again on the video I did December 4th, this is the screen you got immediately after doing it. It was a blank pop-up screen. You couldn't claim anything, there was nothing on the screen. So if you got that message, that means you did everything right and you should have the skin in your locker. But again, you won't get this pop-up. So check your locker, go to recent, and you should have this skin in the Battle Royale locker. And of course you'll have it in Lego as well. But if you're watching this video right now and you haven't done my old tutorial, they changed the website. So it's a little different now. Luckily, I had to do this for my son's account, so I will show you again step-by-step -step instructions. It's super easy. In fact, it's easier than how I originally did it because like I said, they changed it. So first of all, you have to go to the Lego website and I will link and pin the website in the description and a comment. You have to click that website. Once you click that, you gotta go down just a little bit in the middle of the webpage, and this is what you're gonna see. It says, let's link up. Unlock a special Explorer Emily Fortnite outfit, head to Epic Games and click on the Lego logo. So that is way different than before. Last time there were three steps, which included signing up for some Lego Insider newsletter. So they kind of tricked all of us. You didn't actually have to do that. So click link me up, and then it's gonna pop up this. This is your Epic Games login. So you can log in via anything you want. Nintendo, Steam, Google, Apple, PlayStation, Xbox, Facebook, whatever. Just log in to whatever account you want the skin on and click continue and put in your password. Then it's going to take you directly to where you have to link your account. And before in my old tutorial, it didn't do that. You had to search for it. So once you log into your Epic Games account, it should take you to this screen. Scroll down just a little and you'll see apps and accounts. Click that. And on the right, you'll see the Lego account. So click connect. They made it super easier. So once you click connect, this is what you're going to see next. It says, where do you live? And then what year were you born? Now I would make yourself 18 or older because if you put yourself younger than that, it's going to ask for your parents' social security number or their credit card in order to do this. So that's a pain in the butt. So put whatever year you want. If you want to make a child's account, I can show you how to do that as well, but it's just a real hassle if you do that. So then it's going to ask you to sign in. And obviously you shouldn't have an account yet. So you want to go to create account. Now this is the part where you got to be careful because it says, who's the account for? And I just wanted to try it out because my son is under 15. So I clicked a child, but I would hundred percent recommend doing myself 16 plus. So let me just show you what happens when you pick a child, because like I said, I did. So then it's going to ask you to pick your child's Lego nickname. So I just picked one and then click continue. Then it's going to say, let us share your info with Epic. So that's good. That's what we want. We want to click allow. And it just says, hey, we're going to share your username and nickname. Then it says, bring in the grown up. So you have to enter a parent's email, which I did. And then it sends you an activation code to that account. And you have to put in your activation code to get them in. Then it lets you create your child's account. So you put in whatever username you want for them, your password for them and their date of birth. And then it asks you to confirm all your permissions, including linking with Epic Games. So you got to click the check mark down there. And then the very last stage is this right here, where you either have to put your parents credit card number or their social security number. So that's why I said, Ooh, you may not want to do that. So let's go back to this screen right here. And if you click myself, then all you have to do is fill out your Lego account information. Again, your first name, your last name, but keep in mind, whatever you put there shows up on the website. So if you don't want to use your real name, don't put it in there. Then it asks for a password, date of birth. Then it's going to send you an activation code. You get that from whatever email you entered. You put it in and it'll ask you if you want to receive marketing offers. I put maybe later for this myself. So now it'll ask for your permission to use your username and nickname with Epic Games. You obviously want to click allow. And then it'll take you back to this screen where it will now say that you successfully connected your Lego account to your Epic Games account. 
and you're good to go. So now you'll get an email as well and it'll say, hey, you successfully linked this. Now all you have to do is reset your Fortnite app, log back in, and you'll get the skin. So let me show you. I'm going to reset my son's account. We're going to log in and it should say purchased items redeemed and then we'll get the items. Okay, so logging on my son's account here, you can see it does say purchased items redeemed. So now we should get the pop-up and there it is, just like that. Explorer Emily, as well as the Battle Royale version. And then the Greebles Backbling. Pretty sweet. So Explorer Emily looks really good in Battle Royale. I don't think she looks as good in Lego, but this is going to be a solid skin. She doesn't get her hat in Battle Royale for some reason. That's kind of strange. So if you go to a normal game mode and go to your locker, it should be under recent. Let's just see here. And there she is right there. Pretty sweet. Now, it does say she has selectable styles. Let's take a look. Oh, wow. She has off the map as well. Look at that. And there's the hat. Okay, let's go. So you can put the hat on and off if you want. That's awesome. I had no idea about this secondary style. Let's go ahead and equip the back bling too, though. So she's part of the True Explorers set. Here's the back bling right here. And this also has a secondary off-the-map style. Although, is that the same color? Okay, no. This one's super dark blue. And this one looks gray in the avatar over there. But it's actually a light blue. Okay. Pretty sweet. So then to get to your Lego version, all you have to... Oh, wow. I just got a free uh, Lego Fortnite theme. I wonder if everyone gets that. Let me know in the comments if you just got that today as well. Beautiful theme, by the way. I played this the other day and it was awesome. So then to get to the Lego version, all you have to do is click on the Lego game mode and it'll be right there. But I don't think you can edit styles. No, there's no edit styles, so you can only get the first style. I don't know if they're going to add that later or not. But obviously, a lot of skins do have edit styles, so I'm hoping they add it. But there you go. That's how you get the 100% free Explorer Emily skin. They changed it up a bit, but it's still easy to do. I just did it in the span of 10 minutes for this video. If I can do it, you can do it. There you go. That's all there is to it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. A like is always appreciated. And don't forget to use my supporter creator code, which is TaperTime.